snake lovers. Perhaps some of you are wondering what a denizen of the USA is doing here in sunny Japan. Well, this is the reason. Annual Japanese 1,000-year-old egg hunt. By the way, my ancestors were Irish settlers until some wise guy evicted them. <laughs> Instead of a 1,000-year-old egg, I discovered a six-month-old skunk. However, the odors are strikingly similar. I found one! Yeah! That must be the oldest egg in captivity. Well, old or not, I'm going to swallow it if it kills me. And if this clothespin slips off, it probably will. Gosh, all wiggly willigans, it was really stuffy in that egg. <laughs> For God's sake, what on earth are you? I don't exactly know. Let me see what the instruction book says. It says here I'm a dragon, a Japanese dragon. A Japanese dragon? I don't believe it. Would you believe Polish? Scotch-Irish? Uh, it also says I'm a fire-breathing dragon. Hmm. Directions. To start boiler, first light pilot tooth A. <laughs> Say, that really works nice. <laughs> well, now that I found out what I am, let's find out what you are. Now, don't tell me. Let me guess. You're a blue weenie. You look kind of cold. That accounts for the blue. Probably one of those supermarket frozen weenies. <laughs> Let me defrost you, little pal. Now, cut that out. We're members of the same family. I'm a reptile, and you're a reptile. You better just take that back. Uh, you're not exactly a reptile. There's a slight difference. Snakes don't have the colossal reserve of stupidity that dragons have. Well, in the future, remember that. Hey, where are you going? Don't leave me alone. Listen, kid, in this tough old world, it's every man for himself. Ah, perhaps there's some sustenance down there. I'll take a look. Maybe I can find something, too. Go find your own hole. Yeah, sure. Here's one. I don't see anything. It's so dark and damp. Uh-oh, that dampness is affecting my sinuses. I'm going to... <laughs> I'm sorry. He's sorry. How do you like that? I'm Frick of these, and he's sorry. Out of my way, you dummy. You're you're a fire hazard. <laughs> I need that guy like I need a wolf on my head. I'm hungry. Well, eat. Here, try this log. How was it? <laughs> Uh, it gave me heartburn. Wait here. Try some nice fresh coal. Well? It makes me hiccup. Listen, kid. I'm sick and tired of babysitting a dragon. But I'm still hungry and all alone. I'm a failure. <laughs> kid, you're a novelty. A talent. There aren't too many dragons around anymore. Take my advice. Go to the big city and get in the showbiz. Oh, thank you, thank you. I'll do it. Showbiz, here I come. It worked, but come to think of it, how could it miss with a pot-bellied character like him? <laughs> Former child star, now box office smash. How do you like that? He can't forget his old buddy. I won't let him. <laughs> Where is he? Gosh, I'll never find him in this vast metropolis. Well, hello there, little buddy. Long time no see. Great Scott, what happened to you? I've grown up to be a big movie star. Really big. Ever since I defeated Godzilla in Godzilla Meets the Space Dragon, I've been the biggest box office draw in Japan. 
You're just in time to see me shoot one of my big scenes. This is where I demolish the city, and the crowds of people panic and go screaming down the street. By the way, do you still have trouble with your sinuses? Oh, now why did you have to go and mention that? Boy, he really blew it. Yes, sir. He really did. One minute he's got everything. Next minute he's got nothing. Well, that show business. <laughs>